metaphor, right? It means literally being removed from community. This is the metaphor that we're working with. That there are folks a lot like who are at this conference who see that there is actually a possibility that these institutions of higher education can make good on what their mission is. The, the potentials of, of community-based research or community-engaged research is really all of us coming together, you know, the sum of all of our parts, um, collaborating, having critical conversations, talking about power, being transparent, and centering relationships. I think, I think it actually highlights and surfaces all of those ways in which society is failing so many people, whether it's like a climate crisis or a political crisis or an economic crisis or a social crisis. When you're working with people who are suffering the impacts of that crisis firsthand, you are compelled, one is compelled to do something other than the status quo. Through those conversations, through those circles come stories about the impact of the crisis and ideas for change. The social context in which we're living is untenable. It's untenable because the environment is falling apart, it's untenable because there's so much suffering. We as knowledge producers and knowledge creators can can't really afford to to remain uh, unengaged. You know, I've asked myself, does my research actually make a difference? And when I go out and I talk with different partners and I talk with different community members and I hear some of the stories emerging out of the work that we've done together, this matters. This matters to a lot of people. We have to reimagine our institutions. We can't afford not to. There was a time when planes didn't fly. We can solve these inequities. We can do that. We need the work with them to develop the networks and the structures and to ride those flows. It's it's conferences like this that are just so necessary. It's really important to to have that kind of uh, collective vision.